What's going on, everybody? My name is Chris, and welcome back to Let's Play Animal Crossing for the entire year. It's currently March the 2nd, 2012. I mean, 13. I mean, why does that even matter? I mean, clearly it's gonna be. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, yes, yeah, so um, it's currently 3.26 p.m., and I am recording this before work. Actually, I should be getting ready for work at this point. Even though I don't work till 5, so it's like, I don't work for an hour and a half. Why the heck do I need to get ready so fast? Huh? 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 Well, the answer to that question is I need to first make my supper, which is to take it, which from start to finish, which from start to going upstairs and putting it on the stove, to finish, to me finishing eating, takes approximately a half an hour. Plus, I need to drive the road, which takes another half hour, so that's an uh, hour and I need to, you know, needs time to get ready and all that, so it's like, it's pretty crazy how much time you actually need. We don't have this painting, do we? That's a strange painting that looks like Clint Eastwood, except with a really, really white face. It's insane, and, and also in the membrane as well. Holy crap. <gasps> we didn't do the raffle this um, month. I didn't even go look at it. Oops. <laughs> really forgot about that. Um, one day when we finished now you run in your circles, Tom Nook. Uh, one day when I do finish paying off like the house and all, we shall go. But we shall concentrate more on the raffles and all that, cause I need to do that. Raffles would be fun. Maybe if we get lucky with turnips this week, cause I'm doing that tomorrow. May, uh, if I do get lucky with those, I mean, we should make a big chunk of money. We should take a big chunk out of our <clears throat> um, house payment. Actually, that's not entirely true. I mean, with only 50k bells, we'll probably like at the very most. And that's only assuming we have we make a profit. Is we'll probably get like 30. K profit, if that. And that's pretty much if, like, you know, I spend all my money and risk it all and such, which would be kind of stupid to do in the first place, unless they're really cheap. Like, if, um, just, I want to say rupees. If turnips are only like 80 bells each, then I'm going to probably buy a lot of them. Because uh, Tom Nook could sell them quite high. Like, you could sell them like 130 sometimes, which is insane. That's a lot of profit. Oops. I got a little check this out. I the video taped to Anise the other day. Nicknamed Dandruff, because Anise is all about flaking. <laughs> that is, I'm too busy to go get my property. Can you go pick it up? Yes. You lazy titty tit. Alright, since we have a hole there, why don't we just go like this? No, okay. Well, it was worth a try. I tried. I tried so hard. That's what she said. You gross. Okay, um, what, who's coming this week? I mean, just within the next few days. Not really within, you know, the week as we're going on. I've heard of that tree. Oh, Katrina! I completely forgot about Katrina. Must have been nothing about Katrina is absolutely certain. Myself, I'm not sure that's even her real name. I completely forgot if Katrina was in this game. That'd be cool when she comes. Ooh, what is this giant fish? This fish of giantness. What is this giant fish? It's Leviosa. I'm sorry, I just had to relate that back to that. I don't even know why they don't even sell them remotely similar, and we got a barbell steed. We got a barbell steed, and his name is Barb. Hey, that's my mom's name. Okay, what the hell what was that? Is someone on the other side of this river? I don't want to see, because I just saw like a big... Oh, it's Paddy. I saw like a big brown spot. I was wondering, I was like, what the hell? I don't have any brown villagers that I remembered, but then it was like, oh yeah, it's Paddy. Who gives a titty? I've heard about the fish hasn't changed shape for a million years. Whether they can catch it somewhere in this village, you know that? Um, talk to me. Huh? Let me tell you about them. Well, you'll never find them in the river. Oops! Wow, I hope I didn't give too much away now. How now? No, don't worry. You gave everything away. You gave all of the things away. Uh, I don't know what that means. Alright, so. We're gonna go to the museum and finally donate this painting. Finally, it's like pff, it's taking years to get this stupid. Hi, hey, Anise. I'm glad I ran across her now instead of going to her house and be like, No, she's not even here. Okay, here's Goose's video tape. Let me keep this long. Yeah, that was really easy. That was easy. That was easy. That was easy. That 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 was easy. That was easy. I'm sorry, I broke. Tomorrow? Wait, today is day 54. Is it? I believe so. I'm like 90% sure today is day 55. That means... Wait, is it 355 days in a year or 350? 356 is a leap year, right? I do declare. Oh, we didn't sell Tom with the fossils. God dang it. Right? Is that, is that correct? Is that correct on moon day? Oh my. So this is a strange painting. Hmm. Well, it's... There's a certain sort of... I'm sure it's just me, but I don't see why you say it's a strange painting. That's true, I don't get it either. It's okay, Mr. Dude. Mr. Dude, do you, do you tell me that our 
the uh, museum is growing yet. Uh, nope, nothing. Ah, well, hmm, yes, very well. Then I'm afraid myself, I'm still a bit lacking. Shut up! I'm working on it, okay? I'm trying the best I freaking can. And you're like making fun of me. And it's not helping anybody's cause. A strange painting, yay. Holy crap, we're slowly, slowly, slowly. Actually, this is probably the most amount of paintings I've ever had in playing this game so far. Hmm. It's like I have to kind of concentrate on getting the paintings, because otherwise I know I won't get them, like, ever. And if I recall, there should be some, um, butterflies out here right now, somewhere. Right? I believe, I believe butterflies are out during this time of day. I do declare. I do declare. I do declare. Wait, what? I don't know what that means. Oh, no! <laughs> Drop the flower seed bag. I wish when I plant flowers, they immediately sprout up. It's like I have the freaking god finger or something. Is that, is, is, is that growing really? I don't know. <coughs> now we gotta go find goose, and when we do find, <gasps> oh yeah! Oh, there, there's a bug. We, oh, we do have a net. I didn't think we'd have a net for a second. You guys see it? You guys see it? Huh? 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 What is that? What is? What is that? Oh! Bob and Cheever. Hey, call us seven spotted ladybug. It's red and so small and so cute. Okay, I had a dream, and, and I thought it was like a real dream kind of thing. It was like one of those dreams where it felt really realistic to me. And it was Animal Crossing related, probably because it's like, you know, I play this every freaking day. I got a real- Don't you dare! Oh my god! She's the one who sold me the basement! Wait, no, she's not. She's the way it's gonna be, so that's what you get for coming and talk to me. Wow, what an asshole. Ah, oh, great! Great! Just to be ironic, we're gonna get the kitty carpets. <laughs> Because if you guys remember yesterday, we actually traded the kitty carpet for the basement tile, and now we trade the basement mm. tile for the kitty carpet. It's all like ironic and such. Don't be sad, ball. Okay, he's happy, good. Hey, okay, Chris, the afternoon's going for you. I'll tell you, it's going a okay for yours truly. I've got a full belly, and that's all I need. Now, if we got a new shirt, we have like a watermelon shirt. Ah, the weather is great. You know what would be the thing? Things for a nice cool glass of cola. There's no better way to beat the heat. You know it. That's right. It's the best way to enjoy a class of cola and such. You know, if they ever need a fish of cola taster, you'd be the one for the job. <laughs> I thought he'd say he'd be the one for the job. Wow, I can't believe you took my basement tile, even though I honestly don't care about basement tile tiles. But still, it's like, what an asshole. What, an what if they... Okay, if she's gonna steal my ladybug, I would've been pissed. And there wouldn't have been too much of a reason to be pissed because ladybugs are super easy to come by. I'm sure I'm gonna come by another like 30 in the time I play this. Boy, hat, Chris, you look like a big of health. I don't know why I gave him the southern accent. Yes, my dream. I dreamed I was playing Animal Crossing. Oops. And for some reason, the game crashed on me. I was like, oh no. And I, of course, I was right in the middle of recording, which is also weird. Because I was recording at my friend's house. And, of course, none of my friends actually know I Let's Play because I kind of feel like that'd be weird. And it's like, you're playing Nintendo games at the age of 18 almost? Ho ho ho! It's like, I, I don't want to go through that. <laughs> I mean, at the same time, I wouldn't really care if they figured it out because they'd be like, oh, well, that's kind of awkward, but, you know, that, that's cool too. But, uh, yeah, I was playing Animal Crossing at a friend's house. Also, when I crashed, I was like, damn it. And I was, not only was I playing at a friend's house, but I was also Let's Playing at a friend's house. So it was like, then it crashed, I was like, damn it, and I restarted the game, and for some reason, I don't want to say it restarted me, but it kind of restarted me in the sense that, like, it put me on a different map, and it played, like, it kept my name and all that, it was really weird, and it was actually, like, when I loaded it up, like, when I first played, when in my dream when I played the game, it was this Animal Crossing game, but after it crashed and I started it up again, it was Animal Crossing City Folk. Not only that, but it wasn't exactly a first person point, actually, more like second per person point of view, because it was kind of like over the shoulder kind of thing. It was crazy. It was like insane in the membrane, and, and then like I remember uh, it crashed again, and then I played it, and it was a different map again. I was like, oh, what the hell? How am I gonna do this game now? I can't do a year run of this game when it keeps like restarting on me like this. And I was all sad and stuff. Hey, look, another ladybug. That's actually funny. <laughs> right after I said, don't you dare take my ladybug. Yeah, and I was also in the dream. Also, my friend's house was, for some reason, it was also mixed in with my work, since at my work I, like, um, do deep fry, or I, like, clean up the deep fryers and all that. So, at my friend's house, there was also deep fryers, and it was really confusing. Now that I think back on it, it's like, what, why is, was, uh, I don't know, it's really strange, and bewildering to me. Hey, who? Yes, indeed, that's a spotted ladybug from the I'm mistaken. No, no, that's not necessary. Please, I must insist we leave it in the container. But of course you say I won't. I have to say that I'm not overly fond of insects. I quite simply do not like touching them. Blech! Blech! Who? Ladybugs are one insect that thought might appeal to me. 
Then I gave the grievous error of touching one. The fire flew and appeared from some place and oh, it was everywhere. <laughs> to un utterly appalling. Hey, but I digress. If the deepest was found granted. So yes. We have now don't need the butterfly I mean the butterfly, the, the dandelion, the Ah oh, What the hell? Oh. From that angle when the pill bug moves, it's like uh graphics move up and down on I I forgot we caught a honeybee already. Uh, it's it's like graphics all kind of glitch out on the back of it on the pill bug. It was scaring me. Oh, there's a ladybug. I was like, what the hell is this ladybug? It's on the far on the background. And there's also a yellow butterfly. Look at the butter. There's the butter on the butterfly. I guess I see what's called a butterfly because it's yellow like butter. Ha 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 well, obvious answer is drugs. You like, you know, I've been doing so much heroin and cocaine. And, okay, I'm just not gonna even go there. <laughs> don't do drugs, kids. Cause yeah, seriously, don't do drugs. They're bad. Okay, okay. Trust me, I'm almost 18. I would know this stuff. <laughs> uh, okay, I just t uh, t I've tweeted this, tweeted this, that um, one of the biggest reasons I cannot wait to be 18. This is Goose's house, right? Is because I'll finally be able to watch age. Of course, he's not in. I'll finally be able to watch age-restricted content on YouTube. I hate when I go to watch a video and it says you must be 18 to watch this video. <laughs> it's like, ah, oh, really? I don't want. <laughs> like, I just was gonna watch a Marble Hornet video. They just posted like right when I'm recording this, and I was when I click it, it said, "Sorry, this uh, this um video was age-restricted," and I was like, "Really?" How the hell is it? like? I mean, it was, it was like a paranormal activity style thing where it was like, um, there was a video camera on the bed, and I think, anyways, this is really dark, so I could barely even see. But still, it's like, really? Come on, man, I should be able to watch this. I'm close enough to 18, but yeah, honestly, for like, it's not even like recently I've thought about that. It's like for the past like five or six years, whenever I would go on YouTube, I would run across like an 18 year old video. I was restricted for whatever reason. I would go to watch it, and of course, it'd be like, "You could watch this. You're 18." I'd be like, "Ah!" I used to have an account that was, um, I made an like 18 plus account, like you know, I put my age as 18 or whatever. And then it was dumb because it wouldn't even like, or because once YouTube like kind of redid their system where you need to have an email address to sign up for something. Like ever since then, I haven't even been able to like access that account. So it, I says I must put a new email to it, and I don't feel like creating an email just for that account to watch like some stupid 18-year-old video that's like not well, not 18-year-old video, but you know, video that's like requires you to be 18 because that'd be a waste of time. And it's like eh, whatever. I don't care about the video that much. But still, I want to see Marvel Hornets, man. Well, there's a way of getting around that if you um. If the video is embedded in another site, it doesn't check like your YouTube account, and like it doesn't pop up with a message saying it must be 18. You could just watch it anyways through the like embedded version. So yeah, I'm surprised that was never fixed. To be honest. Hmm. Indubly, okay. Yes, yes. Hey, Chris. Uh, how did uh, what? How did a steak head, a steak head like you get a barbel steak like that? Seriously, how? It's like shriek head. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> really? Such injustice. If I creature like that, would something? We both. Agree agree that you clearly don't deserve it. So why don't you give it to me, the marble seed? Sure! What the hell about? I mean, if someone actually talked to me that way and, like, demanded I give them something like that, I'd be like, really, bitch? Screw you! Because I'd be, like, angry and all that. Because, like, you can't ask something from me like that. I'm doing you a favor and you're being an asshole to me. Why would I be nice to you when you're being an ass to me? You know, ass. Who even knows? Mysteries. Stupid Yukon or stupid yokel, yol yodeling. Yodele! <laughs> right, let's plant this here. Why not, right? There we go. Perfect. That's probably gonna die. I don't even know why, but it's gonna die. But I get the feeling it's gonna fly so high in your asshole. Okay, there we go. That was my run. Uh, I've been watching too much as right reaction. The tumor is getting to me. <clears throat> Ooh! Another ladybug that we haven't caught yet. Because there's a seven spotted ladybug, and then there's this asshole. Hey, asshole! Hey, asshole! I'll cut a ladybug! That's one tiny bug, lady. Indeed it is. I've been recording for 14 minutes. Give or take 10 or 15 seconds due to like, you know, starting up. And so we got a fossil! Okay, we're not getting mail off fossil today since we don't have any paper left. However, let's go donate this ladybug, shall we? We might as well. Oops. Oh yeah. 
I forgot about that. If you press L, you can immediately grab stuff. I was gonna take a look at. Oh, yeah, we're starting to make a small dent. Why are we seeing so many ladybugs? Bob was just straining another one. Aw, poor Penny. You just freaking stole stuff from me. You stole my basement flooring to me. Oops, let me think. Yeah, I have no idea. an idea. I need to take this to close. What the hell? Why does he need such like the central central of the central? I'm catching on you. Give up. What she needs to move tomorrow. That'd be sad news bears for L all. It's not like Eunice. I mean, she's really nice. Get it? Eunice. E nice. <laughs> Anyways, so let's go to the museum one last time. One last time will be. I wonder if you could unequip the items by pressing L now. Oh, you can! Because, I mean, normally you have to, like, click it and then grab, but if you just press L, it immediately takes it off. I never knew that. I, kn I used I, I knew that you could press L, but I just kind of forgot about it to like take items in your inventory. But I didn't realize you could like unequip stuff like that. That's awesome. That's totally awesome, dude. All right, let's give him the ladybug. The bug of ladies. Ah, ooh, yes indeed. I know why I keep reading this because he says the same thing over and over again up until the point where it's like I have to describe the bug. I have to say I am not overly fond of it. Hey, like, what what crumpets and hey. Hey, bugs, I want. Yeah, we already want right this. The vile fluid and such. And digressing and deepest, most profoundest gratitude. Your support is greatly appreciated. Alright, alright. Okay, do you say. Ah, oh, well. Really? What do you mean it's lacking? I've donated so much stuff. I've completed the freaking fossil portion of the museum, and you're still saying that I don't have given nothing. Uh, I guarantee once we give him like five or six more bugs, he'll. St You'll see otherwise, he'll change his mind. Hey, there's a second ladybug. He's got to, right? It's like, come on, you asshole. I've given up my time and money. I wonder how much money, like, if you sold everything you ever catch for the museum, instead of, like, donating, I wonder how much money you would actually make. I mean, the fossils, well, plus the paintings, too. I was thinking mostly the fossils would give you, like, I want to say, like, a good, like, probably 100,000 bells at least, right? Plus, like, all the... Uh, well, plus there's like fish. I mean, the coal count is 15,000 bells. And there's a whole bunch of other fish. You'd probably get like around 300,000 bells, I bet, right? That sounds about right. I like how the golden, like how awesome this tree looks. You know what? You know what look awesome? This tree in the um, <clears throat> autumn when all the leaves turn orange and red and such. Because, like, mix them with golden trees, that would look pretty freaking good. I'm running around in circles, like, literally. 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 I see. I, is that right? Literally? Literal. I feel like there should be more of an L in there. Literally. Literally. When I was younger, I felt like if you actually set a tongue twister and you'd messed up, like your tongue would actually like tie into a knot. Cause I remember seeing it on a cartoon once. I remember which show it was, but it was on a show where someone would say try to say a tongue twister and their tongue would literally knot out and it like bobble out of their mouth and you go know, and it'd be like I'd be like oh my god I can't say tongue twisters ever I don't want that happening to me. And of course I'd be like terrified of everything, so I would never try them. And then I tried one. I was like oh my god my tongue did tie and stuff. And I was really happy. But anyways, I guess we we'll call an episode there. Guys, thanks a lot for watching day 54 of us playing of course for a year. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. My name's Chris and I shall see you tomorrow. It is! Why couldn't I find you to deliver these clothes? You ass wipe with your freaking Freaky ass, freak eyes. God, stop staring at me. <laughs> mm.